going anywhere too exciting but I'm heading off to Sydney for the weekend uh, for a concert just finished the customs and at the airport just waiting for my gate to open I'll see you guys at Sydney we have arrived to our hotel room da -da -da. and they gave us this cute welcome tea set. So our first stop is Vika. It's a brunch place that I saw on Instagram, uh, on TikTok, and I really wanted to try it out. that I haven't done in a very very long time for just a quick update recently I've just been um, I've just been working I've been working my ass off usually maybe six days a week five to six days a week and like the day that I'm off I'm so energyless I just go to the gym and then rest at home Today I'm going to go to a cafe and have some nice food by myself and go to Fitzroy to do some to do some shopping. Today, and you guys would be wondering, what is she wearing? 
it's my new work uniform. This holiday, I got myself a role for um, a dental assistant, a DA. Um, and obviously, I'm still doing my disability job. I'm balancing between those two. I've cut down a bit of my disability while picking up more um, dental assistant jobs. And yeah, DA is basically just for my experience in the dental clinic. It's my fourth shift today, so it hasn't been much. I'm still in training. I packed myself a little bit of lunch, and now I'm just packing some coffee. So one of my goals this year is to actually be a bit more financially smart and not spend money on things that I shouldn't be spending money on. And one of the big things that took money out of my pockets were uh, coffee. I know some people might say like, but spending $5 a day, $5 a day uh, isn't going to change anything um, for, your, for your happiness. And like that is so true. But I felt like I wasn't even spending spending it on the coffee because I need a coffee, but rather it's become a routine and it's like, you know, I'm holding a coffee, let's go, that kind of vibes. So I decided to start making coffee at home. So I'm looking for a really good investment in a coffee machine, which I'm still sussing out. And also you can I could also spend that money on public transport when I go to uni because public transport is expensive now. $10.60 a day. $10.60 a day. I've got this cute tumbler that I always carry around. Like, I want a new tumbler. I want something that's more aesthetically pleasing as well. But like, every time I take this coffee out, um, someone compliments. It's almost like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. So now, it's I'm being hesitant on changing it because, you know, everyone thinks it's cute. And I'm just like that, so I'm keeping it for now and we'll see how long I can last until not changing it. So I get myself my coffee and my water bottle. And we're ready to go, uh, so let's go. This, me starting this job felt very different as um, compared to my disability work. My disability work, to be honest, doesn't really feel like work, you know? You hang with your clients, you, know, you do a bit of chores here and there, but your main reason of working there is to support the clients and what they do. And some of them are independent, some of them, are, some of them need a bit more of the support, but the house that I work in is pretty good. You know, I feel like I have a really good bond with my clients, which makes the job easier. It doesn't feel like work, like I finish work and I'm not tired. But this DA job feels like work. Number one, my feet hurt. And my feet haven't hurt for a very, very long time for work. Like the last time my feet hurt for work was probably Zara, which was like three, three years ago now. You're so busy, you don't even get the chance to look at your phone which is crazy again because in my disability job it's quite it's quite free but definitely there's a lot more to learn um, as a DA and just being in that environment where you're going to be working in the future and just seeing how like the dentist communicates with the patient and with the DAs um, how the DA works um, and even like looking at the procedures that the dentists do really uh, feels like I feel like that would really help a lot for my future so that's why I decided to take on this job I have been talking okay I've been talking for so long and this Sun is in my face um, because have you seen a shopping center this quiet every time I start work in the morning like I get shocked out by how quiet it is do you like my hair guys? Is it a bit too like, I don't know, too childish? But I don't care. <laughs> guys, I finished work. That was such a long day at work. Such a long day. And now I came to the gym, but before I go in, you know, I need some energy to work out. 
So I'm having my coleslaw salad that I bought this morning. Like, I'm pretty sure yesterday it was raining so much, but now it's so sunny and it's so hot. I don't know how Melbourne weather works. Hey guys, I just finished work at 12 and today I'm going on a road trip with one of my girlfriends. I'm going to Lawn. Um, our main purpose is to go to Toddy's and because you know it's such a long drive like three hours from my house we decided to um, book a place there and just stay overnight and go to the beach the next day and the weather is amazing so really excited just came to pick up my friend and she's I think she's getting coffee at the moment this is my fit today I got like my hair in a three plait with a big black scrunchie. Mama, this is my friend. Yeah, it's like normal. So my fit is um, my hair is my main statement. My glasses are from Gentle Monster. This is from Supre actually, and my pants are from Adidas. All right, guys, I gotta start driving, so I'll catch you guys later. See oh, ya. Bye. 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 this um, love house we got recommended this place by the lady who works at this uh, her, um, our stay we changed our outfit I'm wearing this kind of see-through dress oh my gosh no <gasps> my okay so today our topic of the conversation is 2024 ins and outs because I personally wanted to share this with you guys and I want to do it in a more com like cons conversative co conversation kind of way so I, I personally wrote it on my diary on my journal so I don't remember exactly the, the, the like all the things but one of my outs mm -hmm. one of my biggest outs was um, don't spend energy on people that I don't want to spend energy on mm -hmm. because personally I'm a people pleaser mm -hmm. I like I, it's very hard for me to say no to someone or if they're giving me an energy I would kind of reciprocate the energy mm -hmm. but then when I go home I would feel tired mm -hmm. I don't want I want to stop doing that I'm gonna pause for a second mm -hmm. and then just oh, okay I need to safeguard mm -hmm. my energy mm -hmm. time management like sleep schedule you've been pretty good but it's still like there's ups and downs but then I want to like wake up in a certain time go to the gym or do some jogging I want to make like routine R make a routine. routine throughout the uni semester and I think like having a routine itself is very very healthy for your mental state even though you're sad if you make it a routine you'll wake up and be like okay I need to do this I need to do that so it's so much better well if I say my out first it's to be on time and then my in is like making 10 minutes before on time <laughs> I, I just feel like I'm always so like on time barely but, on time hmm. in a rush in a rush I'm always in a rush you know I'm always forgetting something I, I walk out of the house being like oh my gosh let me just grab all my stuff and let's run mm -hmm. I don't want to do that like I want to have a peaceful morning and like it's, if you think about it, it's just me waking up 10 minutes earlier, but it's so hard well, to do that. You wake up like so early, 6, 5 a.m. <laughs> but I don't know why, but I'm always still like rushing. Yeah, you, you wake up early anyway. Maybe you take too long to get ready. Or, yeah, like, maybe I'm body. like, yeah, maybe I'm like, do it on TikTok. You do, do it the TikTok. No, that's why I put a time. You know how you can put time limits on your apps now? Uh -uh. Oh, you can put it mm -hmm. and then it just blocks you out of the app. Uh -huh. My daily limit is 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's very, what do you call it, ironic mm. because somehow I am on social media, I am making content mm. but then I want to remove myself from that area. Mm. So it's like, I just want to be on it when I'm, when I'm uploading something mm -hmm. or when I need to be on it to advertise myself mm. but otherwise I want to make my life a bit more private. Yeah. I think that's one of my ones that I want to do. 
봐봐 벌써 까먹으니까 이게 뭐가 in and out이야 <웃음> 그치? What's the point of writing in and out if I'm gonna forget? 응. 아 되게 뭐 많았는데 나는 너무 마음 좋지 않아 맞아. Simple is the best thing One of my ins 응. I wanna try red, red stockings 완전 it can't be see through just, just pure red well, stockings I, I feel like it's just pretty But I just don't have the courage to wear it myself Not us coming out like this <laughs> to Coles Express to get toothpaste. <laughs> Not me having a towel around myself. She. What are you doing? I'm so sorry. Mm. Top up. This is a cooling pack. I'm so sorry. 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 I'm so sor